Hey, I'm Black Dragon, your host at ThinkTacticalNews.com. Today I wanted to talk to you a little bit about how to determine if you're being followed during the COVID pandemic. We'll talk a little bit about that after this. I hope everybody's social distancing and staying safe. And the thing that it dawned on me was, you remember, you know how when it's Christmas, how you uh, have to be more careful about driving around with your head up your rear end? Uh, and you got to be more careful because people know that you have gifts in your car and they know that... Uh, that uh, that's a time when you might have more money on you and so the sharks are lurking and we t often tell the women you have to be careful about shopping not have too many bags in the car people are looking for opportunities to get ahead well that also occurs now during this pandemic there are a lot of people that'll be looking for opportunities to get ahead and there are people out here that have not been working in a long time. People that didn't have jobs before. They were living on their hustles. Whatever they were hustling. Uh, some guys might be going from barbershop to barbershop selling fragrance. Other guys might be going from barbershop to barbershop selling fruit. Other guys driving down the road pull somebody over and say, Hey, look, you got a den in your car and I can fix that for you in 20 minutes. These are all kinds of hustles that I've seen people do throughout my life. Hustles where you got to get out and you got to you got to touch people, you got to meet people. I know guys that that hustle uh, 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 window cleaning service where they'll go from shop to shop to shop. Can I clean your windows? And and they're good at it and they do it and they can clean those windows and they can make a livable wage. But when there are no shops open, there are no windows to clean. And these are people that might have slipped under the radar. They might not be getting a stimulus check. What I'm telling you is there are a lot of hungry people out there. And the longer that this goes on, the more hungry and desperate people will get. And sometimes crimes of opportunity will come when a, you look like a big old fat rat or a big old fat piece of cheese to a rat. In my day, we used to call them a mark running through the hood looking like a mark you don't belong here you're not from here and you created an environment for you to be taken and uh, misused abused robbed strong arm robbed whatever folks would do to you in the neighborhood I remember as a kid so we want to talk a little bit in this section or in in, in today's uh, uh, episode I want to talk to you a little bit about how to determine if you're being followed. Now, of course, your head needs to be on a swivel. You need to look at some of our other videos where I, we talk about uh, situational awareness and where you should be situationally aware at this point in time. It should be a heightened situ situational awareness. Uh, and you can look up uh, the video. Uh, I have a link to the video where we talk about that. So your situational awareness is high right now. And you notice that you may have picked up a tail. Uh, they might be following you to your house to do a home invasion burglary or anything like that. So I want you to start developing more than one route to get home. So that you're not going home the same way every time. 
Because one of the ways that we follow people, we want to follow people and find out where they live, is we only follow you half of the way home or a quarter of the way home. Then the next day, we're waiting somewhere on your route that we followed you to, and we pick you up and we follow you that way. It might take us two or three days to actually follow you home. That you wouldn't actually realize you were being followed home. So if you keep a varied route, uh, and then you should watch for uh, things like that. Uh, perhaps you see uh, the same kind of car every time. Things are things you should watch. But the other thing you need to have is you need to have in your mind the knowledge of where the local police stations are, where you travel on your daily routes, and of course, closest to your home. So you think you picked up a tail. So what I want to talk to you about is a verification method to understand whether or not you are being tailed. Uh, and that is called four right turns or four left turns. So if you think about it, four right turns is essentially a square or a circle. Uh, for all practical purposes, it's a circle and no car really should be following you if you're making a circle. Why are they making the same circle? Something to think about. So. I can make four right turns, and you don't do them all blatantly and everything. You just take your time, make a right turn, drive down several blocks, maybe a mile, make another right turn, drive down a few blocks, make another right turn, and then make another right turn. You've essentially made a big old circle. If you see that you're still being tailed through that four right turns or four left turn procedure now you understand that you don't need to go home now's the time to go to that police department and pull up there make a phone call and let someone know that you're being tailed over at the police department so that they can come out and find out what's going on so this is uh one of our think tactical uh, smart stratagems that we want to keep in our head. How to understand if we're being followed for some sort of nefarious reason. It, it means that your head's not up your ass. You're not, you're not floating around with your head in the clouds. You're situationally aware. You're on the ground. You know what's going down. This is a pandemic, and if it continues to extend and people continue to be out of work and continue to not have their ability to do their hustle, then they'll start looking for other ways to eat. And you don't want to be prey, and you don't want to be food. Actually, you want to be always thinking tactical. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah, how about you first?